kitchen. Today we are going to make some crab salad. My husband loves this stuff. He buys it at the deli counter. It's full of mayo, really bad for you, um, and very expensive. So I have figured out a way to do it at home for way fewer calories and much, much cheaper. And it comes together super quick. So I have here all the ingredients. I've got my imitation crab, mayonnaise, uh, a lemon, and celery and dill. And I'm gonna use my trusty food processor. This baby is, I don't even know how old. Um, it has been through the ringer. You can see that it's got some cracks in it, um, but it still does the job. I have a this big brother for bigger jobs, but this is perfect. So I just chopped up that celery into chunks, and now I'm gonna give it a few pulses to get that diced. So now you can see that we just have little pieces of celery in there. And I'll push that down so that the next part goes easier. Next I have my lemon. And when you are going to juice a lemon, just roll it on your cutting board. That helps release the juices. You kind of bruise it a little bit and it comes out easier. Cut it in half. I have my citrus reamer and a um, strainer because I always manage to spill the uh, seeds into what I'm cooking. Well, it takes some acrobatics here to get everything all organized, but we'll add the juice of that entire lemon. And then you can see here, none of that pulp or um, seeds got into our salad. After that, I'm gonna add a lot of dill weed. It's gonna be probably a full teaspoon. I really like to be able to have that dill come through. And then a, what is that? About a quarter cup, a scoop of mayonnaise. I normally use Miracle Whip, I'm a Miracle Whip girl, but this is the um, Hellman's, which I only use for this. And I'll pulse that a couple of times to make the dressing. Perfect. Then I am going to add some pepper and about two cups of this crab meat. This would be less than, this is a big two pound package from Sam's Club, but um, this would be a little less than a pound of crab meat. And then pop this on and give it a pulse, give it a stir, because we want to break down the um, crab meat, but I don't want to turn it into crab paste because that's not very delicious. And one more time. And there we have our crab salad. That's how easy it is. So I've got these nice, pretty hoagie rolls and I am going to serve this up kind of like a lobster roll, but we're gonna cut out this top section and make some room for the crab salad. So I just cut out a little bit of that. You can save that for um, making stuffing uh, for thickening soups, or you can snack on it. And you just stuff it in there. And this 
is how I do a crab salad sandwich in less than, how long, cameraman? Less than five minutes for a healthy, nutritious, delicious lunch. Thanks for joining me. Come back soon, subscribe. I think we've got some meatball subs on the menu.